Alice Chase at Cheltenham, the Sun Alliance, our deep sensation, who runs over two miles today, uh, will go for the Arkle. Anyway, that was the plan when I last asked Josh Gifford. We can see there, and how delighted he must be. I thought actually he might be in front of a television screen because Deep Sensation, if he hasn't run, must be uh, about to run at Chepstow. So, uh, and that is over two miles. That's over two yeah. miles. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, because uh, I think uh, the owner of Deep Sensation was quite keen to come here for this uh, very valuable prize and to take on Bradbury Star, but uh, Josh, understandably, is much keener that he should keep to his own distance and uh, hopefully take both prizes back to the stable at Finland. Five lengths was the winning distance. And uh, this horse, a fine technique, he, he must be a major contender at Cheltenham if he stays that extra distance because although he's uh, a horse who likes to stride on with the pace, John, he's not totally headstrong. He will relax to a certain extent. No, it's, it's building up into a marvellous race, the Sun Alliance. It's uh, not a race for all trainers like by any means, but uh, Josh will be per perfectly happy to win it, no doubt. Josh, sorry. Great running. Yeah, yeah, it's good all, isn't it? Tom, Tom Kemp bought him, he takes all the credit. Mm. And he's done nothing but improve, you know, and he really has improved every run. And he's improved with his jumping. Watch out. He's going to get one up the arse in a minute. <laughs> he's going to get right the, um, But, you know, it couldn't be more pleasing.